All right, people, I asked you guys on Twitter to leave some questions for a Q&A. Some of y'all aren't following me on Twitter. Why? But I gathered myself a bunch of these questions here, so let's get to answering them. I was supposed to do this Q&A when I hit 50K. A couple weeks passed by, already at 55K, so that's been huge. Really impressed with the love y'all been showing recently. But it's right before 2K17 comes out, and I'm gonna be real busy when that drops, so I kinda wanna get this out the way now. And I never did a Q&A in a while, so I just kinda wanna answer some questions. First question asked, who is the hottest YouTuber? Now I had to think about this one a little bit, then I was like, oh no, it has to be this one. There's a YouTuber I follow for absolutely no fucking reason. She doesn't make up videos. Your boy don't need me. I don't, I don't care. But I just, sometimes I'll click on the video, I'm like, I just have to appreciate what's there. And the YouTuber's name is Lissetti. It's 95% males on this fucking channel. I'd be surprised if y'all were watching makeup videos as well, all right? So someone, yo, where's the hookup? I need a plug, I'm trying to get the digits. Next question, can you get the 2K servers to work in Australia? I got a plug for that, hold up. Yeah, yeah, it's about the servers. No, it's Australia this time. Hey man, fuck Australia, everybody from Australia, man. Fuck that, ain't nothing there in Australia, man. We make the servers there bad purposely, man. We ain't nobody from Australia buying the fucking game, yo. Fuck. What's your favorite movie? Interstellar. It's not even a fucking question. Movie starts off slow, but all that slow start comes back and you're like, that shit from the beginning of the- what the fuck? If I don't leave a movie so thoroughly confused that I'm having a two hour conversation at Tim Hortons about it with my friends after the movie, then it's not even in the conversation. What team do I dislike most? The Boston Celtics. Nah, I'm playing. I'm playing. But I did just get a bunch of Boston Celtic fans really fucking angry. How far do you want to take it on YouTube? Let's answer that first. As far as it's letting me go, like I don't, I, like I don't think too far ahead. Some people, like I walked into an interview, they're like, "Agent, what's your five-year plan?" I'm like, I don't know. What's I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow. Like, <laughs> come on. Like I don't know what I ate yet. Like I, I'm not focused on that. I'm just focused on right now. Five years from now, I can wait. I'm not worried about in the future right now. Cause in the future, you're gonna be worried about the future. And if you're never worried about right now, Agent, come on, you need to set goals because you need to reach the goals. Nah, I'm doing good right now. Yeah, I'm doing fucking amazing in class. YouTube's been doing better. It's like, I don't, mm, I don't need, mm, I, I just haven't thought it out, yo. Meaning, are you looking to hit that one mil? Of course, man. Everybody's trying to hit that one mil. Who is it? It's nice, the 2K community for a long time was just smooth, they hit the mil, but now it's, Who's it, Cash it hit it and Fredo hit it? It's like, yo, it's possible now, bitch, everybody hitting the shit. What car do I drive? No, that's a good question. I don't know, I drive a nice whip. It's just a nice big body whip. It comes in a timely manner. And you know, the price on it, the price is always just right. It looks a little something like this. I'm a fucking university student, you know, I, I take the bus, of course, come on, man. Do you like McChicken? Uh, thankfully, I'm allergic to the McChicken. Uh, I don't eat wheat, so I'm good. He had to hashtag it, he just made sure he's like, mm, Agent, I want you to know, this is what I'm talking about. No, don't think the regular, I, mm. Will there be another bleach giveaway? Because I feel like the last one was Ray. Come on, man, you're gonna be exposed. Oh, to be exposed. You faked the giveaway. Don't you remember what Expose happened to Unbox Therapy? Uh, Unbox Therapy? If y'all don't know, y'all don't follow me on Twitter, I was doing a giveaway. And uh, I don't fucking know. I I sponsored. I was sponsored by a bleach company. And then there was a few. There was a lot of people who retweeted the tweet that entered the giveaway. And Legend of Winning won it. I promise you, it was random. I even asked Unbox Therapy to help me out with the giveaway. It's ev everything went according to plan. It's. I promise you, it wasn't fucking rigged. But we'll do another one, and we'll do it bigger this time. All right? Would you shoot me for six point three million dollars? Is that even a question? Where is the gun? Let me come on. Would you die? You didn't say whether you- I'd shoot you in the kneecap for six points. Of course I would. Yeah, for sure. I'll shoot you in the toe. You can- you can do without a toe. Come on. We can split the money. I'll give you like 40% or some shit. I'll hustle. Like, we'll definitely have to negotiate. We can do 50-50 if you want. Would I kill you? Would I get away with it? Do you think I'll get away? I don't know if I'll get away. I'm not sure. What do I think about Colin Kaepernick and other athletes supporting him? Listen, I'm from Canada. You, in America, people are just so like, Oh, the flag and everyone is so patriotic and it's, it's not nearly like that here in Canada Like I went to a graduation to my cousin down in Dallas Y'all did the American anthem They did like some sort of it looks like some some sorority speech I don't know they had their hands up like this I was like is this hit is Hitler in the building like y'all go overboard with some of that shit Kaepernick is just trying to bring awareness to some shit that he feels some type of way about giving people a voice Now whether you agree with the way he did it or not he succeeded in starting a conversation in the in the process he fucked 
fucked up his whole career, but... Hey, just, how could you say that about the flag? I mean, what are you talking about? He's not like he's lying about shit. There's people that are oppressed, yo. Fuck, y'all pretend like it's just not there. Not you specifically. I know you, you're just asking the question. I'm just saying, in general. Realistically, what's your end goal with YouTube? Again, I don't really think too far ahead. Becoming full-time or getting into a sport? I can do both. I can get into full-time and do a sport management job. Like, I was watching a Kick Genius video where they were talking about, like, yo, why you have to graduate and get a job? Like, it's, it's 2016. Like, I can graduate with this degree and use that degree to make some moves that include YouTube. Like, it'd be great to work with Canada Basketball, right? Like, if I was in there and I was an employee in, in the building. But it'd also be fucking great to be a partner with them as a YouTuber. Like, this is, yeah, people, like, it's not that linear. Like, I can graduate with this and I can do a lot of things outside of just, you know, just joining a fucking or random organization or a company to get paid. It is 2016. On a scale of 1 to 10, it's my favorite color of the alphabet. Jaguars or Cougars, either one. I have 55K in, like, we hit 5K in like two weeks, y'all. So y'all been showing mad love um, and 2K17 is around the corner. So it's just, it keeps getting better. I appreciate you guys watching these videos for real, for real. For yo, I need y'all to know something. My channel is not big enough for me to compete with the very large YouTubers. So when I ask for likes or when you guys leave comments or any sort of interaction on the video, when you watch to the end, it helps my video rank better that's what it does and so my video will land in more people's home pages my shit will land in it'll land more on suggested videos or on search and so if you guys don't like the videos like my channel will not grow the person was asking why his channel's not growing is because if you have a small channel you don't have the luxury of asking and getting hundreds and or thousands of likes you don't have that and so when i ask you guys to do it and you guys actually do do it believe me i really fucking appreciate it because it's that right there that helps this channel get support and love from YouTube. Because YouTube just be like, oh shit, that man right there got a nice 300 likes in the last minute. That video must be popping. Let's put it on everybody's homepage. That's how that's how the algorithm works. And so the more homepages I'm on, I guess the better for me. And then the more content I upload, and the better for you guys. It's just everybody wins. So if there's any YouTuber, not just me, who you really support, then show love to the video. On that note, I'm gonna edit this bitch. I'm gonna catch y'all in the next video. I sincerely do appreciate you guys. And, uh, oh, how about we need one more thing? I'm gonna leave a poll. Either, you know how they have those YouTube polls? I'm gonna put it somewhere on the video. Look at the screen right now, right? Click that bitch and answer the poll. I'm, I'm curious what you guys are most excited for in NBA 2K17. I'm not entirely sure what my uploading is gonna be like. And I don't really know what you guys wanna see. So this is your opportunity. Let me know, like, agent, we want you to do this. Or just tell me what you're most excited for. Go ahead. And 2K17, we're all excited. Hopefully they don't fuck up that game because we need a new game to play. <laughs> I'll catch you guys in the next video. I'm out. Peace.